Florian Schultz and Malagamoa getting better and better as he gets more experience with the circuit. The Sri Lankan driver, great enthusiast for racing. There aren't many classes he's not racing. He's coming Malagamoa, who will be cheered on by this army of supporters that he takes. He's done it before, he's going to do it again. Through he goes. Dilenta Malagamoa up into second position. Fantastic. Fastest lap of the race, incidentally, Carrie Schreiner, uh, who was really pushing. It's a shame about the drive through for Carrie. She's back up into 13th place as Malagamua comes up to have a go at Laurent Jenny. No respect of reputation here, Delanta Malagamua. Laurent Jenny was the AM champion back in 2013. So, I mean, uh, a good scout to try and play. Malagamoa looks for a way through as they come down towards Rabatza. Can he get up the inside? He's done it before. He's going to do it again. Through he goes. Dilenta Malagamoa up into second position. Fantastic. Now, Philip Vlasic fancies his chances of getting another spot out of this. And wide in the background goes Perez, elbowed out by Vyskoski. He comes across the road and hits Hardwick. It goes off in very high speed into the wall. Big impact, two cars off, that's going to be potentially a stoppage, never mind just a safety car as they have to try and pick their way through the debris. JC Perez ran out wide, he came across the road, clipped Hardwick, Hardwick into the barrier, uh, with two cars not quite blocking the track, but certainly restricting the width. I fear that this might end up being a red flag, it is, the race is being stopped, it's a stoppage. No safety car, but a red flag, a race stop. And you can clearly see why, with the two North American Championship drivers in real strife, uh, what a very disappointing way to end what had been a very lively race. And on the count back, of course, Delanta Malagamur would lose that second place, potentially. So, Ryan Hardwick, who had that big, big impact with Perez, and then a second impact into the barrier, opens the door. But the former jet ski world champion, a little bit winded and a bit shaken, and also off the road has gone Tim Richards.
Atalanta Malaga was third place. Arguably should have been even better, but tremendous celebration. Atalanta has his own program, motoring program back home. He's a real celebrity in Sri Lanka. And so many Sri Lankans, I only wanted to win. What a better way to win, and look at all this crowd behind you. I'm the luckiest sportsman in the world with all these people with me. Bless you, well done. So, Delanta Malagamoa, I said during the race, there aren't many classes and many categories he's not raced over the years, but we've seen a lot of him in Europe this season, uh, which has been very, very good to see indeed. And a very, very competitive weekend he's had here. It's a new circuit, but it shows what track time does, because, of course, normally you get two races of a weekend. Here, uh, it has been the four races, and the more mileage you do, the better you get. And it's really paid off for Delanta Malagamoa this weekend. Pitch Pass, beyond the track.